Yo, what's up guys? My name is Storms and welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to teach you everything you need to know about the Fire Dragon in Minecraft. So, I was excited, but so am I. Let's get started. Okay guys, so as you can see, here we are in this world with my body, an ice dragon. So, yeah. Fire dragon, not an ice dragon. I'm sorry, it is a fire dragon, and it is one of the strongest dragons out there. So, you know, I thought that why not make a video? You need to know about ice and fire um, fire dragons, as they are my favorite type of dragons. So, I thought let's make it. Okay, let's get started on telling you everything you need to know about ice and fire Minecraft. Dragon Fire. Let's go. Okay, fire dragons. They usually spawn in hot bars, plains, and forests. And they can be found from stage 1 to stage 3 above round and stage 4 to stage 5 underground in the dragon caverns. They sleep at the night when they are tamed or not tamed. And we set the time to day, they wait back up again. And now let me show you how you can tame a dragon. So first, you can either go down, such as go under, into the caves, and try to look for a dragon. Well, if you cannot find a dragon, just try to keep looking for it, as one day you will find it. So I'm sure about that. And then make sure it has to be a female. If it is a female, click it with the empty hand that would allow it to drop its scales and eggs and then you can get an egg okay now once you've got that you can place an egg you can place a nether blot play um light it on fire place a dragon egg and it's gonna start spinning and that's when you know your dragon is gonna hatch so wait four minutes and then boom your dragon is gonna hatch so now that your dragon hatched you need a dragon to monster off, a dragon horn, and some dragon meal. The first agenda you want to do is, you know, put the dragon on stain by right clicking it with the dragon to monster off. And then put right clicking him with the dragon horn to put him in a dragon horn. Don't worry, nothing's going to happen. Then feed it some dragon meal. So, you know, you feed him some food and then he can carry you. Okay. You need it to be stage 3. How to check if it's a stage 3? Just shift right click on the dragon. You will see everything here. You will name the dragon by right clicking a name tag on it. You can check the gender. You can check the hunger. You can check the stage. And you can check the honor. So, that is how you can tame a nice uh, a fire dragon. Sorry. And that is the main thing. Now I'm going to show you everything later. So now as you can see, we can ride it. But you might be thinking, how do I ride it? Well, if we click escape, options, controls, and go down, you can see all these things. So if you're playing with Ice and Fire, you can see gameplay. And that is what you need. So right here you will see everything such as attack and destroy dragon breath dragon strike dragon down so don't worry i have some pretty wacky controls i know but what can i do it's just my style okay so attack and destroy is a left button which is your normal mind drop but we're here to talk about dragons so as you can see that you're gonna see three options dragon breath dragon down and dragon strike so then um, you click on the dragon breath and click which button you want it to be. I set it to Q, dragon down, I set it to left alt and dragon strike the G for um, the G as the default. Okay, and now as you can see, this is you just want to fire dragon up, just right click it and use the jump button. Mine is spacebar and use the W A S T to control your dragon. Like any other dragon, and on stage five or stage three, who knows? You have now unlocked the ability to spit out fire 
boy look at this so as you can see right here we have like such immense power in our hands we are just born in this outpost like it's absolutely nothing but it's, it, it is nothing you can burn the whole world in fire and make the whole world land do we care absolutely no now that you have brought in your female dragon well yeah, that is no everything ice and fire fire dragon in minecraft i hope this video was helpful and it was also a tribute to my best friend astros um dead dragon well be sure to watch us and he had a big sister called blister which was my dragon and basically one day we went sea serpent hunting and yeah basically i blister survived and i survived but scorch and astro yeah it was a tragic moment well anyways we can't change the past so yeah thank you all so much for watching this video and i will see you in the next one